On May 19th, Mikhail Gromov received the 2009 Abel Prize from His Majesty King Harald at an award ceremony in Oslo. Deres majesteter, excellences, mine damer og herrer. Geometry is a central field of mathematics, and during the last 50 years, it has undergone a revolutionary change. And Gromov has been one of the key figures in this development. He has uh, influenced not only geometry, but also other fields of mathematics, and his work has changed the perspective of many fields of mathematics. It's not the first time the Russian-French mathematician gets recognition for his work. In 2002 he was awarded the Kyoto Prize in Basic Science. To get a prize in Abel's name is a great honour, Gromov says, and he's a strong believer in that the world would not look the same without Abel. Well, for me, I mean, this is a, it's a trip, it was, I was very excited, of course, very happy, and it's, uh, I mean, it was quite a, a very unbelievable thing to happen. And for mathematics, it's... it's the, the fact that mathematicians being appreciated on a large scale by society, I think it is good and gives some idea for everybody that mathematicians are of certain worth, yeah, which is usually is not obvious. And uh, this, I think, the most important, of course, in this prize is the name of Abel, which was a great, great, great mathematician. And this, for, for, for the world, may be most important to, uh, to, to explain that there were really very great people in mathematics like Abel, and that they influenced the world, the world in a much greater way than just uh, having the, their name attached to a prize. Yeah, mm -hmm. that was, uh, it's, it, which is very difficult to explain how strong was the impact of such people like Abel on everyday life. Yeah, our life would be not exactly the same if not for such people like him. Yeah. <laughs> 